Hi boys and girls, I am so excited! Look what I found on the clearance table! It was not in a box, it was just sitting like this on the clearance table, so I picked it up and we're going to open it together to see what's inside. It's called a dinosaur busy board. So let me open it up here. <gasps> oh, here's our dinosaur, boys and girls. What you're going to be doing here is um, learn how to buckle things. You're going to use your fine motor skills, which are your hands, to learn how to do different types of buckles. And this thing moves. Over here we have... Let me put my glasses on so I can see what we have over here. Oh, the days of the week. That first day of the week is Saturday. And you have this thing here that you can go down to the last day of the week. And the last day of the week is Sunday. Then we have a clock, a.m. and p.m., different weathers and the different seasons. Or you know there are 12 months in the year. Well, the first month is January and it goes all the way to December. Moms out there, if you're looking at this, there are so many skills here that you can teach. Let's turn the page. Ah, this is my favorite, boys and girls, the shapes and the colors. Hmm, I'm looking at, here's some of our, some of our basic shapes. The triangle, square, and circle, and it goes all the way down to the diamond. But for the toddler, we would start with just basically these three shapes here and these three colors. But this right here can be used all the way to second grade. You can take these off. So you can take this off and you can put it down on the table. And I'm not going to take all the shapes off, but we will now, let's see, I'll pick up this one, and this one is a square. You can teach the shape, or you can teach a color. So you can go and match it, and it matches with this one right here, which is a square, a blue square. Let's see what this is. Mm, this is a circle, and it's purple. Go over here, and then the last one is a green triangle. Triangle has three equal sides, so it doesn't make any difference what side you put this one on. And let's go over here. A puzzle! Here's our dinosaur again! A puzzle means you can take pieces off and then put them back on. Okay? So you can take all those off and put them on the table and move them all around and find the pieces. This is really good for your brain. All of this is good for your brain. And the more you use your brain, the smarter you get, boys and girls. Let's go to the next one. Oh, numbers. You have your hands. You have the fingers. You have five over here and five over here. Here, I love this. I just love this. Because you can look at the number. There's one. You have one bead, and you can move that bead over to the other side. And look at it again. One. You can visually see you have one bead. Over here is number two. You have two beads, and you can talk about colors also. Two purple beads, purple, and move it all the way to the other side. And then you have two beads. And look, you go all the way down to ten beads. And mothers, you can have them count each single bead and put the little finger on each bead. They can move it around whatever way you want to have them to do it, but the more they touch, the more they retain. They will retain this longer than just seeing it. Just this, all this movement is great. Over here, let's see, what is this? These are different uh, motor skills. Ah, <laughs> mom, this is awesome. Have them practice tying their shoelace. This is for your belt, and this is for uh, but buttoning, and what is this? Oh, snaps! Great snaps! And as I can, I see zippers here, so you can unzip this and pull it out. Like I said, you can use, this is 
can be used by a toddler all the way to second grade. And you can, if you have, you know, children of different levels and different ages, you can give each one of them a different board. What is this called? A board, yeah, busy boards. Take off the board. Well, I'm not going to zip that, but you know what I mean. Take it off. And let's now look at the back here. On the back. Oh, my favorite! The letters of the alphabet. There are 26 letters of the alphabet. Upper and the lower case. And they have an animal that begins with the letter A. It looks like it's an alligator. And looking at this, oh, these are all animals. That is great. They're going to introduce the letters of the alphabet with different animals from A to Z. And, of course, Z is for zebra. Zebra. And, boys and girls, on my channel, my Sunday Heavener channel, I have all these animals, in fact, all these animals in real life on my Sunday Hefner YouTube channel. For I have over a hundred of these videos called Alphabet Animals. So if you love the alphabet, I will be teaching you every letter of the alphabet plus its beginning sound like A is A, B is B, all the way to Z. Z, Z, and the phonics, that's the phonics, and we will be singing the alphabet song. So, boys and girls, we have unboxed the dinosaur busy board. And boy, this is a toy, but it's an educational toy. It's like a purse, or you can call it a suitcase, whatever you want to call it and learn a lot of things that you need to know in school. So this is an extra way to have a lot of fun to review or to practice all of the skills that you're learning in school. Or if you're homeschooling, moms, you can start with those little toddlers. In the near future, so be watching for unboxing educational toys. Bye!